Hello. Being scammed can be great, but some people do get involved with scammers and then the lure of money from these criminal activities, um, people actually go bad. There's a thing called a shipping scam where people actually receive goods and they reship them from their house onto someone else. Uh, so the scammer in Nigeria or wherever or Russia can actually um, say that they live in that state or live in the states. Problem is a lot of the scammers have a lot of people working for them on reshipping scams. So you might think this person's being very honest and they live in that town country and they're working and they're traveling back and forwards for their job over in Nigeria or whatever and they've just got home, then they've been called back out on the airport again to go back over to Russia or Nigeria or other countries. I'm just using Russia and Nigeria as an example. There are a lot of good Nigerians, but there are some crooked ones that even the Nigerians don't like. But there some um, people who've been involved with these Russian or with these uh, reshipping scams or going bad have actually faced the consequences and are serving jail time or that they've got a pending um, jail attendance for it. Oh, anyway. But anyway, the, the main part is that um, some victims can turn bad because they get involved with the scammer and get involved with um, shipping scams and, and credit cards where people are stealing identities, using the credit cards and then posting it to someone else. They collect the goods and then they move it on to them. They get a little bit of money and that's it.